Creating from scratch uh, takes a little bit more work than cloning. On the template grid down at the bottom you have the new template button on the left hand side. Clicking on the new template button will give you this screen here, the edit template screen. You select which format you wish to create the template in and of course we will be looking at Word. You give the template a title and the template type. Clicking on the next button will take you through to the Edit Word template screen, which we have seen already. You can create any notes in here, a, a task, assign an email template. Now you do not have the option to open the template down at the bottom left here because there is not a template assigned. So we are going to be clicking on Open Merge Codes at this point, and then from the bottom of our screen, clicking on a Word document to open up a new blank document. So we're going to be starting to create this template from scratch. First of all, we may be inserting a logo. So we'll just insert a logo quickly. More on this later on. So we'll then insert a logo. We'll then think about starting to add some merge codes in. So very simply, because we're going to look at this further um, in more detail later on in the video. Clicking on to a merge code, it's a simple left click of the mouse, up to the top, right click, copy, and then pasting it into the document. So you'd be adding in your merge codes, and so on, and then writing the body of your email. Adding some merge codes perhaps in here as well. And then finishing off your letter. With another merge code. Once you have created your new letter, always remember to save. You do not want to lose all of your hard work. So file, save as, save it somewhere easy to remember. You can always delete it later on. Closing down Word, closing down the Merge Code panel, on this screen here, pressing the Select button and uploading your new template. And then Save. You will then get the new template as well on the Our Letters tab, as well as the cloned one.